Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the vlog. If you're new to the channel, big warm welcome. My name is Tristan Mortlock and this is Captain's Vlog. We have a very, very special episode for you guys today. We're going to be checking out this submarine. Now, these kind of toys are fantastic, especially if you've seen my previous video videos about the shadow boats. If you may remember, we checked out the Damon 47 and the Damon 55, which are both support vessels. And these are one of many toys that you have on board. So we're going to meet Roy now from U-Boats Works. He's going to tell us all about it. So let's go and check it out. Of course. I will show you how to get inside the submarine. Uh, you don't have any, you know, you don't have a watch. No, the damage, no. I hope the air conditioning is good. Uh, it's on 16 degrees, so... Oh, oh, okay. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> You're laughing. We can have our cold beer in there, Roy. Yeah, 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 we do. <laughs> Step in now. Yeah, the steps here. Yep. Hold on to the handrail yes. with, with both hands. Both hands, yeah. Stop step on here. Yep. And then just lower yourself on the on the two foot pedals you see there and then, then just choose uh, either one you see and mind your head. Uh, absolutely. Yeah. Understood. And then can I step on the seat? Is that okay? Yeah. yeah. from U-Boats Works. As I mentioned earlier, when we were on board the, um, the Damon Shadow Vessel, these are one of the toys they can have on board. And the best thing about hanging a submarine is, you know, most of the water sports and the adventure is done above the water. But with this, you can explore so much more. And Roy is gonna tell us all about the benefits of having a submarine, how the super yacht industry uses it, so how your clients use it, what are the benefits, and why would we buy one for a shadow vessel or support vessel? Yeah, yeah, gotcha. Right over to you. Gotcha. Thank you, Tristan. Um, well, first off, uh, I'm Roy. I'm the marketing manager for uh, U-Boat Works. Uh, U-Boat Works is a company that's been in business for 15 years, uh, producing uh, submersibles like the one we're in at the moment. Uh, this actual submarine is a Sea Explorer 3 submarine that can go down to 300 meters. Uh, it's a three seater. So, so, so for the American viewers, that's about a thousand feet. That's a thousand feet. Yeah, yeah. sorry, sorry. For the American viewers, that's yes. a thousand feet. Um, it's a submersible that can stay submerged for uh, for eight hours uh, with uh, three persons. That's two passengers and one pilot. Um, you do need to become a certified pilot to be able to uh, to operate one of these things, but. Yeah. How long does that normally take, um, the training wise? Uh, it takes about two months of uh, uh, theoretical training and then some, uh, some, some practical dives. Okay, yeah. all yeah. right. And do you have, to have any kind of training or diving background? Or you well, go it helps if you have okay. a diving background because right. you are able to tell what you can see on the water and that's part of the experience, you know? Uh, having a, a skilled pilot is one thing, but being able to tell a story and share those experiences yes, with, uh, with the people inside, that's... Yeah, that's that's uh, uh, I I would say ninety percent of uh, of the job. Okay. Yeah. Oh, fantastic. Um, we uh, have a universal controller. Uh, that's. Uh, let me see if I can unlock it because it's locked at the moment. Yeah. There we go. There we go. So this actually is the universal controller for all our submarines. So that means if you become a specialized submarine pilot on the Sea Explorer three. Uh, you can also uh, pilot one of our other submarines. You don't need to take uh, any other additional courses, just some, some uh, other training dives, because submarine handles the same. Fantastic. All. 
all the time. So, and but, but one controller for all the subs. It's one exactly controller the for all the subs. But wow. the beauty of this thing is that it's so easy to operate and to use that even the passengers can can steer if they would like. I encourage them. <laughs> <laughs> okay, great. So let's go on a little bit more about the use of it. You know, tell us. Why you know why would a, an owner of a super yacht mm -hmm. want to buy one of these? What what is the benefit of having a sub? Um, well, there's just so little you can do above water and so much you can, you can do, do underwater. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, that's that's so basically. So the, the majority it. of the clients are, the, are they doing more like polar regions? Are they doing more tropical? A mixture both, of both. Both. Okay. Yeah, um, we uh, see a lot of our uh, submarines uh, from January to March uh, yeah. in the in the Arctic regions. Okay. Uh, because of summertime, yeah, um, and 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 we we do see a lot of uh, our clients uh, from January to March in the polar regions with uh, with our submarines. Uh, it's uh, summer there, and uh, uh, it's beautiful. And you can see the the whale migrations and the penguins, and uh, it's an amazing time That's to be awesome. uh, in the Arctic. And yeah. then uh, in in summertime, obviously, they're in the the Caribbean uh, waters or in the in the Red Sea, and. Uh, yeah, that's amazing. Yeah, well, you know, the submarine is one thing. Yeah, it's it's an uh, if I can speak for myself, it's an amazing piece of machinery. But the experience, yeah, I can't explain you to can't you. What, yeah. No, I can't explain what the experience is of that's being amazing. in one of these. Yeah, yeah. it's really incredible. Yeah, it is. How thick? What is this material, and how thick is yeah. it? Yeah. Uh, well, this actually, the dome itself, yes, uh, which the whole submarine is built upon, is uh, an acrylic dome. Right. Um, it's uh, this one is down to 300 meters, so it's about 10 centimeters thick, okay. and it can withstand uh, 31 bars. Oh wow! Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So that's about five five inches, 10 centimeters. Uh, yeah. Yeah. yeah about, more or less. About, yeah, more or less. Ten bars. That's gonna be fantastic. Yeah. And what? So I know a lot of questions is people are gonna think you know claustrophobia if things goes wrong. Mm -hmm. What are the fail-safe systems that you must have on yeah. board so you know people can feel more comfortable when they're passengers? in this type of vessel? Yeah, well, um, safety is uh, of the utmost importance. Yeah. It's, it's, it's the baseline of, upon which we build all of our submarines. Um, all the fail-safes are uh, redundant, so uh, they have backup fail-safes if anything goes wrong with the first fail-safe. Um, luckily, uh, nothing ever goes wrong because they're uh, certified uh, by DMVGL standards, uh, so they're, they're classed up to the, the highest class you, uh, you can get. Um, but in case of any emergency, if anything does go wrong, um, well, first off, let me let me start by telling you that uh, a submarine, um, when it's on the water, it's always slightly positively buoyant. Yes. So that means it always stays afloat. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. So even if you do nothing underwater, it will go up. It'll go up. Yeah. Yeah. So that's the first fail. Yes. If power fails or anything fails, you you don't have to do anything. You you just go up. You have. Uh, uh, even if the uh, if the oxygen fills, you have 30 minutes or something to spare oxygen. Yeah, right. Um, and then you have the 96 hours of emergency oxygen if you get stuck or anything else. Oh, so you got eight hours with three people, yeah. and then you have 96 hours of emergency oxygen. Yeah. So you can. And on the top of that, an additional 30 minutes. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Okay. So uh, you can stay submerged for uh, three days. That's amazing. Yeah. Yeah. Um, it, you do ne get to know each other yeah. for three days, yeah. and there's no toilet here, so a nice smell in here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Of course. yeah okay, but um, yeah. Um, luckily, we, we never had any uh, any accidents. Um, um, we do have a, a drop weight on the bottom that's made of uh, 750 kilos of just dead weight. So right. if you drop that, you can yeah, shoot, shoot, shoot straight up. You shoot straight so up. So then, let me ask you then. So then, obviously, it's a pressurized capsule, right? Yeah. So how does it work then when you're going up and down in comparison to say to a diver? Yeah, you don't have any decompression. So it's, it's total. It, it's atmospheric. It's yeah. atmospheric pressure. One, one, atmospheric. one bar. Yeah, one, on one. The inside. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, okay, no yeah. problem at all. Yeah. And then a question for you for your new clients. I see you have the Bose stereo system here. Mm -hmm. Do you play the theme tune from Jaws? The movie? No, we do Beatles, Yellow Submarine. Oh, do you? Do you? <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. I love it. Fantastic. Well. Guys, let me know what you guys think in the comments box below. I think it's a fantastic toy. I think, you know, underwater exploration is so much to see in the Arctic, in the tropics as well. Um, you know, having, going back to the support vessel, having one of these things really does bring the client's experience on board to the next level, you know. Not only above the water, but below the water, 
and more and more of the super yacht world are exploring the Arctic areas and doing going further afield rather than the typical Mediterranean and Caribbean. So I would like to say, Roy, thank you so much today for your time. You're welcome, Tristan. Guys, I hope you really enjoyed that video. If you did, um, well, if you want to find more information about uh, U-Boat Works, I put a link in the description below. Please do consider subscribing to the channel and click that like button. If you like the merchandise that we're wearing today, you can check out the merch shelf below. But for now, from Roy and I, it's goodbye, and we look forward to seeing you all next video. Hey guys, I'm Richard Orm, the founder of the Clear Ocean Pact, a pact that is leading the change in yachting to reduce its dependency on single-use plastics. And we're making this happen. We have 60 yachts that have joined the pact in just a year, saving some 22 tons of single-use plastic from being consumed. But we need your help. We need your help to hit our target of a thousand yachts by November 2020. So please, go to the address below, download the pact. It's free, it's very easy to use, it's voluntary and non-accredited, and start reducing your single-use plastic today. Thank you very much.